Hey, so I filmed eight auditions yesterday. I really can't believe I filmed that many. I, I knew I needed to film that many, but I didn't think I was going to be able to do them, but I did. And one of them was actually for a reality show on Netflix. So I am um, subscribed to Casting Networks as far as their email lists, like their little, what are those called? Newsletters. They're new, the Casting Networks newsletters because I do submit for San Francisco and LA for just acting a lot of commercial things and um, short films, indie films, and then background sometimes. I didn't find this casting call, casting call on Casting Networks, but I found it through their newsletter. They shared a um, an article from, oh shoot, I'll link it below so you guys can see the article that I'm talking about. I forgot what the name of it. It was a really, really short article, but Basically, Netflix is doing huge open casting calls for their reality shows. So I'm a humongous fan of Nailed It. And I my friend just introduced me to Love is Blind during a girl's trip. And I thought that show was so cool. It's such a great idea. Um, so they're casting for those things. And then they have a new reality show coming up called Roaring Twenties, where they uh, it's look like it looks like they're going to set it in Austin. Texas and it's going to be about people in their 20s trying to you know succeed in a big city so they're casting for that too if you're in your 20s um this casting call is not at all for anything scripted so Bridgerton never have I ever anything like that this is not for that they are not casting any actors so for this one they're actually asking you to submit a one minute video or less of you just telling them about you and what show you're interested in and for this audition they're asking you to do it vertically which is complete opposite of if you're an actor you know self-tape auditions are usually horizontally um you know they ask you to do it horizontal so yeah this one seems super easy I had already had needed to put my makeup on yesterday for other auditions just because like this is the makeup I do for my auditions and um, I happened to be wearing makeup, but I just did a quick video. I did two takes and the only reason I didn't use the first one was because I, I think I either stuttered or it was too long. It was over a minute, um, but I just did two takes and then I sent it over. You know, I was honest about what show I wanted to be on and it was super easy. So I went on to netflixreality.com and then I clicked on the ones that I'm interested in, put my contact information and then uploaded my video, which my video was 52 seconds. But when I uploaded it straight from my phone, the file was too big. So I went and um, put it through Premiere Pro to make it into a smaller file. But if you also have that issue and you don't have some editing software I'm sure you can just google you know your phone and whatever app you use to film how to uh, compress the, the the video so you can figure that out it'll be super easy and yeah so if you're interested in joining this open casting call I would suggest submitting to it sooner rather than later because this is Netflix and because this is reality a lot of people are going to submit because it is really easy to submit. You don't have to memorize anything and you don't have to act like anything. You just are being yourself. Um, I'm assuming a lot of people will submit. There's a lot of really popular reality shows that people want to be on. Um, I really would love to just be on a food competition show. That would be so much fun to be able to, like, nailed it would be so much fun. Anyway. Yes, submit sooner rather than later because a lot of people are likely to submit and usually when casting gets different auditions, they will see it in the order that it arrived. So if you are person number 12,643, it's going to take them a lot longer to get back to you. And that's the other thing. If you aren't an actor, you're not in this industry, then submit it and then forget about it. If they're interested in you, they will contact you. I don't know how Netflix is uh, going to be doing this if they're going to be telling people like you have not been selected but they are sending you a confirmation email once they have received it and then they're saying give us a while to reach out we will contact you if we're interested so if they're not interested it's very very likely you will never hear back from them so keep auditioning if you are interested in 
acting, not just reality. Um, I make acting related videos all of the time and um, I just finished doing a self tape every day in July and right now I'm taking a little bit of a step back from YouTube and not making anything too crazy because I have been getting a lot of auditions. I had eight auditions yesterday, like I said, I am pretty sure that's the most I've ever done in one day. And then today I have four. One of them is a repeat from yesterday just because there's a little bit of um, miscommunication in the self tape request. So they're like, oops, actually we wanted you to do this. So I need to refilm one of them. Um, so yeah, so I'm just taking a little bit more time with my acting because I felt like YouTube took so much of my time in July. And in general, I, I put a lot of work into my videos and editing and thinking up ideas. So I'm like, let's, let's take it, let's, let's step back a little bit and, um, doing something like this where I shared with you guys a huge open casting call for Cuban actors a few days ago. And now I'm showing you this reality open casting call. But, um, yeah, if you're interested in getting into acting, I make acting related videos all of the time. And I I have hundreds of videos up already about where I get my auditions, what websites I have used, um, how I film myself tapes, my experience as an actress working in San Francisco and LA. And um, yeah, I'm based out of California. I do acting work in San Francisco and LA. And that's pretty much it. I'm going to go film these auditions because I was actually feeling really sick this morning from, uh, you know, the beautiful visit we get every month as women. But I'm feeling a lot better now. So I'm going to go film those auditions uh, and send them in. And thank you so much for watching. At the end of every video, I feature another channel. This is today's feature. If you would like to be featured on my next video, make sure you're subscribed, like this video, and leave me a little comment about the type of videos that you make on your channel. And then I can talk about it and say, go watch their videos about plants. <laughs> I have a lot of plants. I don't have that many plants. Okay, bye.